strong move and then the put back and follow and up and in and early going here it's the uh, transfers for Florida State that are leading the brigade. Junior Florida State women's basketball player Shatrice White has been granted immediate eligibility for the 2016-17 season. The former Illinois All Big Ten performer shocked everyone, including herself, upon finding out that she would not have to sit out for an entire season. We were trying to really downplay the possibility so that we wouldn't be extremely disappointed. And we had played without her in practice. She had gone to China. And um, so it was a, a big surprise when we got the news. Coach Sue called me. She's like, hey, are you home yet? And I said, no, I'm on my way. What's up? And she said, oh, OK, well, just go home. And so I said, OK, well, so I'm going home. And Coach Sue is sitting outside of my apartment in her car, just standing there with the biggest smile on her face. And she was just started screaming. She was like, you got him. You got granted to play this year. We're so excited. And I was just shocked. I just sat there for a few seconds, just like, what the heck happened? Being granted a media eligibility for Chatrice was not the only exciting thing ahead. FSU women's basketball gets to look forward to a new competitive teammate and an incredible addition to the ACC hopefuls. The attitude of the team, uh, you know, we were really excited. Um, when she first got here, of course, even the recruiting visit, I was so excited, wanted her to be here. And so just knowing that she's able to play with us this year is like amazing. As a strong rebounder and scoring threat, Chatrice adds a huge inside presence. She hopes to bring the same on-court intensity off the court as well by being the best teammate she can be. Coming out of high school, I wanted to play for a team that had never done anything yet. I uh, wanted to play for a team that uh, was going to allow me to grow and uh, become a better basketball player with great coaches. Um, just wanted to be part of something bigger than myself. Well, you know, I think we've already put her in a really competitive environment. It's not just competitive in the ACC, it's competitive here at Florida State to get on the floor. And so to help her to realize that um, she has so much more in her, that her capacity for greatness is so strong, is so big, and now we just need to teach and mentor her to that next level. And I think she'll be a tremendous pro one day. This team has high expectations both on and off the court. Not only do they believe they have what it takes to be ACC champions, but possibly go far in the NCAA tournament as well. They're really high um, because I see the potential that we have and, you know, we can be so great. It's just, you know, working hard every day and getting it done. But ACC championship um, is something that we're striving for. And whatever comes after that, you know, is just icing on the cake. I'm expecting great things from this team. I think that we can go really far in the ACC and in the ACC tournament as well as in the NCAA tournament. But I think uh, taking it game by game right now and just growing and improving with each day and each practice, I think, is going to be huge for us. But I see a big future for us. With Chatrice added to the team's lineup a year earlier than anticipated, FSU women's basketball, Coach Sue, and Chatrice's teammates are ready to conquer their goals. I think everybody in the ACC starts out wanting to win an ACC championship. You know, we've been able to do that in the regular season. We'd love to win a tournament championship. Uh, so those types of goals are in front of us on a daily basis. Chatrice, I'd like to see be a huge contributor towards that. Um, somebody that we can count on night in and night out um, to be an integral part of our team and not just in what she does, but how she does it. Chatrice continues to impress her teammates. Her competitiveness and caring personality has added depth on the court and her eagerness to show up to a championship shines through. I'm Taylor Cavender for Seminole Sports Magazine.